Hello, welcome to my shop. If you've been here before, welcome back. If it's your first time, I'm happy to have you here. My name is Eric Nethery. If you recognize this demonstration that I have behind on this whiteboard illustration, you'll remember when I talked about changing gasoline from a liquid form into a gas form to be able to burn it efficiently. So today, I put up a demonstration that you can see from start to finish to exactly how that's done. So, I have a little pond pump here that I'm going to pump air through the gasoline, through these tubes, and it's going to transform into a gas, similar to propane or natural gas, travel through this clear tube, and we're going to fire this Bunsen burner. Now, a few things can change inside of this tank. We can adjust the level of the gasoline in here. We are going to use this for an extended period of time, like to fire a furnace or a hot water tank, then this level would be maintained with a float system of some kind. We can change the, the size of the orifices in the tube. We can change the amount of air that's going through the tube. All of those changes will change the mixture and the fuel itself. So for today, for this purpose, we're going to see how this works. Please don't try this at home. So the first thing I'm gonna do is plug in this air pump and we'll see the bubbles going through the gasoline. This gasoline is the same that you buy for your vehicle. We're going to turn it into a gas. So now we see the bubbles in the tank. Now the top of this tank is full of a gas and this gas is traveling through this hose to this Bunsen burner. So the Bunsen burner is the same as it would be if it was running on propane or natural gas. And here now, this Bunsen burner is operating on gasoline. Thank you very much for stopping in. We'll see you again next time.